Entertainment Weekly has unveiled first look images at the upcoming Murder on the Ori Orient Express remake directed by Kenneth Branagh. The 20th Century Fox film is itself an adaptation of the classic Agatha Christie mystery, assembling a huge star-studded cast that includes Branagh, Johnny Depp, Michelle Pfeiffer, Daisy Ridley, Judi Dench, Penelope Cruz, and Josh Gad. The story takes place on a packed train where one of the passengers is murdered, leading Branagh's detective to take case in order to try and figure out what happened and why. Murder on the Orient Express opens in theaters on November 10th. Jeremy Byer saw the first images from Murder on the Orient Express. I buy the images, I buy the crew behind it, I buy the director. I'm a fan of Kenneth Branagh and I, I, I like what this is going to be. I've never seen the Murder on the Orient Express, one of the five like remakes and Murder on the Orient Express versions that have come out. I haven't seen it. Went on the Spirit of Washington dinner train, did a murder mystery <laughs> then. It's no longer around, but I did it. Murder mysteries on trains are a time-honored tradition. There's something really cool about uh, uh, su such a like it can only be in so many spots, you know, whatever it is right in front of you. I don't even know if that's the premise, but it's called Murder on the Orient Express, so that's what I'm assuming it is. Perry. This is a huge buy for me. I love the look of these images. And this is not these images, but that EW uh, cover photo. That is the first Entertainment Weekly cover photo I've seen in a very long time that had me, oh my God, I need to see this movie. Look at the ensemble. The way that they had that ensemble lined up, you can't look at that group of people and not be completely overwhelmed by the amount of talent in this movie. And they're doing a really cool thing with the promotional campaign for this now. And it started with that EW cover where they're hiding clues in all the promos. And then you you can go on their website and you if you find the clue and enter it in the right spot they'll give you information on the characters and you know it's not anything game changing where you're going to get to see early footage before anyone else or something like that but it's just a really cool way to to get people into the story in a way that's kind of using the plot of the movie too so look on that that ew uh ew cover and see if you can find the clue and then you go enter it in on the website it's really the first one is really easy to find Christian. Yeah, I'm going to buy it for sure because I automatically think of the behind-the-scenes trailer videos that uh, Josh Gad, Judi Dench, and um, Daisy Ridley did together. <laughs> but no, I look at these images and it reminds me of Clue. Uh, I mean, now whether or not right. they're going to do it in, in that vein, I don't know, but it certainly reminds me of it. And I and Kenneth Branagh, this is right up his alley. And I think that the biggest buy, the reason I'm buying it is because I know he's directing it what he's capable of doing as a director. This is something that he could really lend his expertise to to make this a lot of fun, very interesting, work with a great cast. He's a, he's absolutely an actor's director, and with this cast, that's what you want. So I think it could be pretty interesting. It's not going to be a gangbuster, like, big blockbuster movie with making a lot of cash. It's just not. Um, it's going to be a movie that we hope makes a lot of cash. But, um, yeah, I like, I like what I'm seeing. I got to buy this for a couple of reasons, mostly in starting with Kenneth Branagh. I mean, this guy, if you go all, go all the way back to like his Henry VIII stuff and whatever, and then look what he did with Cinderella. I mean, it, this is coming off of like Maleficent where we all thought, oh gosh, these live action mm -hmm. Disney things are mm -hmm. not a good idea, this thing. And then they give him Cinderella and he takes an incredible ensemble cast and he makes that a wonderful, wonderful movie. Even if you've never seen the original Cinderella, he did such a great job with that. He made Thor cool. He made Thor incredible. Yeah. That's why that first Thor movie was one of my favorites for a long time. You look, and then you give him source material like Murder on the Orient Express. This, I, I don't know how you do anything but buy this. So this looks great to me. It's a buy.